in the early days yes i had coaches come up to my parents and tell them that uh, this boy will be a champion no matter which pool he trains at. right even if he trains with a coach who's an absolute idiot right he's still going to figure out how to be a champion yeah, because that's... he's got so those are nice yeah. things to hear from coaches right, right. But what mindset did you have? Were you like extremely focused, or were you casual? But you were just good at it, like you know, naturally. Right. I was seven when I started. Seven, right? And I was very competitive from a young age, hmm. so I just had to win. You know, that was my priority. That was, and that. that was always my priority. And I think everything that, in terms of effort, was driven by that goal to win. Right. So by the time I was nine, I was at the Otters Club in Bombay, and right. then I was competing, winning silvers and bronzes mm-hmm. at state level. And at eleven, I became a national champion in right. my age group. That was the under eleven category. Under eleven. Okay. So at that point, I clearly knew I had some level of talent. I mm-hmm. may not have been a breakaway one in a million talent, but right. I knew I was talented. Right. But what uh, I what came from within was I was very hardworking. Hmm. and part of it was because i was just innately disciplined as a child right and uh, also because there was a there is a lot of pressure when you compete from a city like bombay because your education pressure is high your pressure to perform is high in the early days yes i had coaches come up to my parents and tell them that uh, this boy will be a champion no matter which pool he trains at right even if he trains with a coach who's an absolute idiot right he's still going to figure out how to be a champion yeah, because he's got so those are nice yeah. things to hear from coaches right, right right but like i said i was always hard working and i've always believed if you've got some sort some amount of talent mm. and then you combine that with a good work ethic you have a champion sure sometimes if uh, an extremely talented child will win his gold medals a little earlier than a child who's not as talented sure but yeah. eventually you will find success hmm. the important thing is to have that combination which is what i had which right. is why i feel i was successful